Hi, and welcome back. Did you realize there will be seven things that we'll no longer see in a new heaven and new earth? If you want to know what they are, stay tuned. This is according to the book of Revelation, the last book of the Bible. Number one, no more sea. Revelation 21, 1 says, Then I saw a new heaven and a new earth. For the first heaven and the first earth had passed away, and there was no longer any sea. Wow. Kind of weird to think about, right? I mean, we're used to these huge bodies of water on our earth. Imagine there being no more sea. My theory is there'll be so many of us that we need room. However, there is another mode of thought about this, that sea is actually a symbolic uh, figure of speech to mean no more storms, no more separation between man and his brother. Number two, no more death. Revelation 21, 4 says, He will wipe every tear from their eyes. There will be no more death or mourning or crying or pain, for the old order of things has passed away. Right now in our present state, we're all actually very slowly dying. But in the new heaven and new earth, our bodies will be alive and perfect and made perfect and we'll be living, truly living, no longer dying. Number three, no more mourning. This is also mentioned in that same verse. We'll see our friends. We're no longer pining and, and missing our loved ones or our friends. We'll be seeing them and we'll recognize them too. Number four, no more weeping. This is also mentioned in that same verse. No more depression, no more anguish, no more anxiety, no more hiding under the covers of our bed, no more sadness. It'll be a blessed relief to say goodbye to all of that. Number five, no more pain. Also mention that same verse. We'll all be in our perfect bodies. At long last, my arthritis will be gone. My eczema will be gone. It'll be awesome to be in perfect bodies and not feel any pain or no more bad backs, no more bunions on our toesies, no more disease. It would be so awesome. No more doctors or big pharma, no more cancer. No more diabetes. No more of all those diseases. Number six, no more curse. Revelation 22, 3 says, No longer will there be any curse. The throne of God and of the Lamb will be in the city, and his servants will serve him. This means that we'll no longer suffer the, from the curse of sin, for we will never sin again. <laughs> We no longer have to suffer from making bad decisions ever again. No more addictions, no more cigarettes, no more drugs. Just living in beautiful, perfect bodies. Number seven, no more night. Revelation 22, five says, there will be no more night. They will not need the light of a lamp or the light of the sun for the Lord God will give them light and they will reign forever and ever. Oh no, how am I gonna get any sleep? <laughs> Actually, I suspect that in our perfect bodies, we won't need sleep anymore. This is one of my favorite verses that reminds me of a better tomorrow. Here it is. First Corinthians 2, 9 says, however, as, as it is written, what no eye has seen, what no ear has heard, and what no human mind has conceived, the things God has prepared for those who love him. Just remember, the best really is yet to come. Let's remind ourselves of that. Let's encourage each other as we count down to the rapture, which really could happen any day now. Take care, read often, pray more. Will I see you again soon?